Welcome back to Let's Cash More Mash. My name's Tom. And I'm Mike. And today we're cracking open a semi-new bottle of Old Elk Sherry Cast Finish. This is another, another bottle brought over to have a review by super fan of the channel steve came over that's why it's a semi-new bottle because we might have cracked it and already tried it uh he got this bottle for 85 dollars. it's a five-year bourbon it's a 109.7 proof now I, I i believe one of the other ones we did recently had the same thing i i was just intrigued by the mash bill because it's 51 percent corn 34 percent malted barley as the second and then 15% rye at the I think end. that was which, the last elk we did, right? The last one had that same thing. So I'm doing a little more dig and dive and trying to give you more different research on, on old elk itself. And it's kind of confusing. I think, I forget the guy's name. It's Greg Metz or something. He used to be the former uh, distiller at MGP. So I guess when he was at MGP, they used these uh, unique, because MGP, of course, subs out to everybody. But they were making, before he, he quit them, they was making these unique mash bills first for Old Elk. So that's how they get, like, the five-year. Because I think they're brewing some at Old Elk now, because it's in Colorado now, and he's actually working for them now. Um, so I'm not 100% sure if this is MGP, if it is actually their juice or what it is. It doesn't really say. It you say know, on a bar. I mean... Read well, my story. bottle reader isn't uh, the best, so I, I couldn't tell you on... Uh, I was on, reading the story. It's the same story yeah. on every bottle. I no, I know that. Down well, so, and that's why I was, trying Let to me look, see. I was trying to look for something new, you know, something different. So that, I don't know, and, and I was kind of mainly looking to see, you know, because that is, I've never seen a mash bill like that, you know, other than with these guys. But I guess the, the, the way one of the stories that I had deep dived into... Says it's distilled there. See, I know that's why what confused me when I was oh, looking. Bottled. It's bottled here. Bottled. It's not distilled there. So yeah, bottled. Yeah, I'm not sure. Right. But if anyone knows the fact of it, you can leave a comment down below because people might be interested. You, but you know, that's our specialty. No, no, no. It, well, I was actually trying to find out the information, and it was like, geez, I'm not getting. I just couldn't tell. I know, I know the guy works there, and I know that you know it's. Remember, we said uh, it was like one of the founders of Otterbox yeah, and yeah. somebody else, yeah, yeah. and you know what I mean, like. And they made this whole thing, but I I heard now that they, you know, according to the internet, and we know that would never lie, that someone's actually they are the still. Nor do we. But they've only started in like 2017, so some of the stuff is probably still sourced. You know what I mean? So because everything's gonna age. And five, being this is you a you got your five year in there though. Do you have it for that? That's why I said there is a slim chance right. of their first thing they did. But then it also sits in a the nose has this, something different. This one sits in a sherry cask. The nose has a lot different in it. Yes, it does. It does. It actually dives out of the glass, which is one thing to me. Like it, it's it's no, it's yeah. strong coming out. And I, I I'm gonna go back to I believe it's the fact that the malted barley is so high. It almost has like a pasty finish. That doesn't sound like I want to drink it. You say pasty. Uh, it's you, not, it's you, not, you, you not back in kindergarten <laughs> eating handfuls of paste? It's just, it seems thicker, like a pasty type. I didn't really get a huge oak finish. See, that it, I'm trying to keep quiet over here because I, 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 I'm kind of going back to when Steve and I did it. Um, then I'm just I'm trying to see what you get for notes before I, I spiel off the craziness Yours? that's going on in my head. I can I can you can kind of get that the sherry cask. You can kind of get that mellow finish of that. There was a sweetness in in, in the finish, and, and that and, definitely and, and, brings and you to even, like a fruit, like, which yeah, will bring yeah. you that 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 on there. And and, and minor in the nose with that, but then there's something else in the nose. Okay, spill it. I, I, I'm not disappointed, other than it's up there. No, price, price wise is going to be my issue. I on mean, that. The, the, but the bottle again, the cork, everything, uh, they get an A on all that. I, I am really digging the fact, and I'm hoping it is the malted barley. It really has a, it has a, a strong flavor on, on, your, on your tongue when and, it hits. And I guess that's, that's my relation is the pasty part of it. And it could be because it actually coats and sticks. So it does, if no, that's it, what it you is. mean by pasty. Yes. 
like it, I, I mean, some of them. Sometimes you drink it and it's water esque, and only no. the proof hangs oh, it out. Sticks on your tongue. It sticks on your throat. First of all, one hundred nine point seven proof, oh. right there in my happy land. I, that's like one of my favorite. Right, one hundred ten is a great proof. Anywhere one hundred eight, one hundred ten. Yeah. I love that proof. Second of all, like there is so much flavor coming out of there. There is. But as we were doing it the other day, the longer it sat in my glass, and I'm waiting for it today. I mean, you really get a strong, and it's not so much a caramel, because I get a hint of like the, it's good. I get a hint of like the little fresh baked bread in there. with I like gonna, a, with I can like almost a, even do a bread or a batter. With like a spread on top. Like initially when we opened it up, I initially instantly jumped into like a zucchini bread. But now as it sat, you know, it's been open for a little while over a week. There is definitely like a, it's got a sweet. There's like a fruity smell no. in the beginning, and I can't tell you exactly what fruit spread is on my fresh baked bread, but it's it's on there. You know what I mean? Like it has like a, and it's not a banana. You know no, what I mean? But no, there is no. definitely it's, a fruit. It's a darker it, it, fruit. It would almost. It, that's what I was thinking. You know what I mean? Like it, it, and it's in on the palate and the very end, you get like this sweetness I, I like that flavor. comes on. I like everything about this. I'm not gonna accept the price, mm. but. Honestly, as far as sherry finished, I mean the nose just keeps and growing. And you, you kind of get it does. It, it just it definitely keeps, keeps better and better. And you get that little bit of a finish, oaky finish, sherry finish, mm -hmm. which that does stand out like the rest of them did. Other than this is a little more proof, but although see, and to me, I, Angel's Envy was that that was up there. That, that's to your. It's right behind you. In fact, it's what was the right proof on that you? one? The the yeah, I don't know. That was a store pick, right? The cast strength yeah. or whatever. I think we're in the same range. I want to say for some reason it was like 107, 109. 103. Yeah, 103.7. Yep. This one, I think, though, it's not only not only am I getting like the, the sherry cast finish, I do get like a nice oaky finish. Yo, like it really has like I a, think it's like a combination of the two. Like I really get a nice finish. should be able to finish. pick that out. <clears throat> right. Well, we hope because it's. I don't. The only thing that's going to throw me is it's such a condensed flavor. It might actually bring me into like, like the Elijah Craig book is. No, land. well, I mean, if you can get for, that for fruit. the Sunday Fun Day idea that you had, you. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we should be able to distinguish this between the others. I don't know. We had one with Armagnac too, oh. and and that's going to uh, be yeah, in yeah, there yeah. too. That's going to be one of his things. Steve's got the something, nose is really Steve's good got something it, so. planned for us, so stay tuned for a future for Sunday Funny. That's what he's talking about right Sorry. now. But uh, that's okay. <laughs> it'll be it'll be coming out. I'm not 100 percent sure what it will be yet because he's he's still in the works with it. But uh, overall, it, you know, it's very good. If this wasn't 85 dollars, I would be rave all reviewed. Them, but it, you know, it is there, finished. Got to give it five years. It's in a finished barrel. Every time someone puts it in a finished barrel, same thing with they like this it, one. It, all... it goes up. They you know, do. even even Angel's Envy is, is pricey because they that got was that 70, extra, though, wasn't it? Well, that was that was a yeah. Well, that yeah, eighty nine, eighty nine. Yeah. So I mean, even a regular one's up there. It, it's one of them. Why knock them over? You know, it's. So I mean, it's uh, with the sherry. A lot of them seem to step up at least ten dollars more than the regular. Right. At least a minimum of a ten. I'm not disappointed. I mean, again, what would you want to pay for this? Like, if, if but well, you know course, what I mean. Everybody, it, you'd be way happier if it was fifty nine ninety nine or forty nine ninety nine. One hundred percent. I think that would be, is even I, in that price range. So I think that would put me in my happy place if it was say sixty bucks. Like you could because well, like you know, the, it, like the bakers. Well, or not only the bakers, like 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 and it's makers. Not finished. Like when uh, you yeah, get yeah. the when you get the BRT one and two, I think they're at the seventy now, or it was like sixty to seventy. Yeah, they are. So. I mean, it's not outrageously priced when you come to it. You're going to drag his ass around to a store one of these days and actually see, let him see the prices. Oh, no, I see them all. <laughs> well, only, only the receipts when they come in. No, no, no. You, you, know, how many, you know how many pictures he sends me of I all know, the crazy I prices? But plus, I, 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 I'm in bourbon groups. I, I, I see like I, some I of the crazy the infl too. inflated prices. Want to play this he, one? he thinks I, have, I never walk in stores. I do. I, we just, again, every time... I start thinking we'll I have can to get, take a picture of, of our little bucket of I can, joy. Over yeah, there. I can get rid of one of my boxes full of booze over there. We fill the box back up again. So it's just that the Santa sack is never going down. It doesn't seem to. So, I mean, I'm not as much as I normally harp on prices. I think I would buy this one again. I, I, I would. Or I would buy it for the first time because Steve mm -hmm. bought it. Because, I mean, this has so much flavor. It does. And it has, as it, you, you can know. See. 
No, it it honestly, it really does. It it, it is so tasty and it does See, not. You might drink. be disappointed. It'd be lower. It does not drink at a hundred. No, no, it's very good proof either. Like, cause there's so much flavor in it. It's it's it just sticks around. I you know, it, it hangs there. So, all right. Well, if, he he. You know, he, I knew he was going to do this. I don't even know how long this video is going to be the shortest video we ever put out there. Really? Captain Slurpee over here was thirsty, <laughs> I guess. So, no, being that it's not our bottle, thank nope, you again, that's Steve. Why I'm behaving. Thank you very much. Yes, thank, thank you, you again for, for letting us try this one. Uh, you may see this one again in a future Sunday fun day because I, I know he's got something planned for us. So, I'll be interested to see how that works out. Yep. I just want to comment one more time that the nose in this no. is just getting better and it better. Does. And, and that's the one thing with this one. When we drank it the other day, I'm like, it just, as I kept going, because I don't even think I gave any of my tasting notes, but it turned no, into, a huge batter. It, there's like a, a bread with a spread, but then I was getting a little hint of like chocolate going on the top of it too. I'm getting it, a chocolate. If any, I might even get like a, a strawberry. No, there's definitely a, a fruit in there. I, I, and, and there's a nice sweet finish. I mean, it it is. A very good bottle. Pricey, but very good bottle. Very, so, very. There you go. We'll leave that one. We'll leave it at that. Old Oak, Sherry Cast Finish. You know, if you don't mind spending the money, it's worth every penny of it. I would can be. say that much. So, it would be. That being said, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I don't remember how many of this is, but again, we're running the lights on low. Leave a comment down below whether you like it, whether you like my new edits and stuff. And uh, spend less, drink more. Cheers. Cheers. Hit that subscribe button. Bye. I missed it.